Game Caviar. Yo, YouTube, what's up? It's not having it back with another Game Caviar production. This time we have Gotham City Imposters blasting straight from the beta on uh, PS3. I'm using the Game Caviar PSN um, uh, game tag, PSN ID, whatever you want to call it. But yeah, anyway, this is this is amazing this game is very fun if you don't know what this is this is a uh, first person shooter about a bunch of um joker imposters and batman imposters and they go at it this is a online only video game that is uh only available for download it's coming out this month this month in february and during the beta you have um this game mode which is called fumigation it's like domination and then you have some other game modes that I don't really play. Now, right there, what I did was um, they have they they have a lot of the stuff that you see in regular first-person shooters, but they just call it something different, like uh, funny facts or your perks, and you got your you know your primary guns, secondary guns, and then you have uh, gadgets. And what I did right there was I used the gadget that actually turns me invisible, and after I blow that guy's ass off, uh, they um they that comes. That, that really helps when you're taking over these fumigation units and uh, it, it allows you to not become completely invisible but unless the person is really paying attention they won't notice you there and it's kind of cheap I know but whatever it works anyway um, I'm trying to blow this guy's ass off right here with rockets I think I finally got him or somebody got him uh, right there see I cracked open a bottle and I'm starting to use the invisible thing well the beta comes with two levels, this level and then one at a theme park. This level is really small and it, it really is, um, it's not as action packed as the other levels. So you won't see that much action. I mean, you see a little bit. It's not like I'm just, you know, on, on uh, sitting in one spot the whole match and nothing's going on. This game is really fun. I really had a lot of, uh, a lot of fun playing it the past couple days. And uh, I, I looked online to some, uh, on some forums and a lot of people just don't have a good um, they don't have anything good to say about this game probably because they don't understand it they don't understand this this is just a game I mean it's a fucking game just like any other fucking game if you don't like it don't fucking play it uh, it's nice to have your opinion about it but when some people just went completely overboard with this saying that this game was actually trying to feed off of the success of Arkham City and uh, Batman Arkham Asylum what they fail to understand is that you put Batman in any fucking game is gonna be popular because Batman is popular what part of that didn't they fucking understand um, I don't know where this guy went he hit this trampoline and um, he just disappeared anyway this is this match is almost over, but this video isn't almost over. I took the liberty of recording two matches for you guys, so you can so you can actually see both maps and get a complete feel for this game. And right there, what I did was I picked up a prize box. Periodically throughout the match, prize boxes show up out of the clear blue, and if you pick them up, you get special you get prizes <laughs> because they're a prize box. Right there, I got some sort of defense prize booster that uh, I didn't need to use because we won. And uh, I like how they do this at the end. They show the top three um, performers for that particular match. And what they do is they, uh, you you know, you get everybody who played in the match gets to see your gamer tag and whatnot. It's just a, a good way to flaunt yourself and your accomplishments during the match. Um, with me, a lot of the times, action like that getting points like that is hit or miss sometimes i get a lot of points sometimes i don't it all depends on what am i what i'm doing i do like to be a team player in this video game and it's like uh it in and, and it's not like a time limit thing it's it's a score limit and a time limit but um it's like a sliding scale actually you know the team that controls the most fumigators they get more and more points and whoever gets to 100 percent first wins the match if time limit expires uh what is it is it the time either way somehow or another you get to go into over um sudden death where you go to whoever gets the uh the most fumigations and uh i think if one team holds all three fumigators then they win I'm not too sure. I don't really go to all of sudden death. I make sure that my team has the best chance of winning because I get in this match and I go ham. I don't care. I go and I get these fumigators. Um, 
like I said, there's no certain time limit for these matches. Now, we as a team could go in there and bust the ass like we did the first match, and the match could be very quick. You know, once you get to 100%, the match is uh, is over. You know, um, let's see what what, what else was I going to talk about? Uh, Game Caviar has uh, we have been working on a big project, and finally we revealed it this past weekend on the Facebook page. If you don't, if you haven't looked at at looked up our Facebook page, go on Facebook, search for Game Caviar. You will find us. If you have any problems, drop me a uh, comment, and I will put the link in the. Um, I will respond with the link, or I'll send it to you through YouTube uh, messaging or whatever. But anyway, we're gonna start an internet radio station on Blog Talk Radio. The first episode is tentatively scheduled for this weekend. Unfortunately, all of us are going to be pretty busy this weekend, so we might have to move that back a couple days. But it's just going to be a 15 to 30 minute, hopefully 30 minute most of the time. But uh, either 15 to 30 minutes worth of us, um, uh, of us going on there and talking about video games in general, how we feel, what we've been playing. We talk about games and we talk about entertainment and we just we just have a good time. Look at that, how I went in there with this rocket and just destroyed, destroyed, destroyed. That's a rocket. I went in there with that rocket and I destroyed. I didn't mean to jump on that trampoline. It kind of messed me up, but yeah. I went in there and I destroyed. I destroyed. And now I'm about to take this fumigator. But I digress. Anyway, I had, uh, yeah, we're going to be on Block Talk Radio. If you're on there, get up, uh, look up, uh, go to blocktalkradio.com, search for Game Caviar. We're going to be on there every weekend, and uh, every weekend for sure, periodically throughout the week. If you like the Facebook page, you will get updated on every time that we have, we are about to broadcast and show schedules. Because I uh, I will make sure that it gets posted on the Facebook and Twitter. Uh, follow me, Twitter, uh, uh, at not having it. Or, um, what is it, at G Caviar? I don't know. Follow me at not having it. And then uh, if you want to follow the Game Caviar one, you can. But anyway, uh, let me see. What can I ask you guys? What can I ask you guys? What can I ask you guys? Uh, do you guys plan on getting this game? Do you know about this game? Do you have any type of information on this game? Is this your first time seeing it? If you like this game, do you let me know if you plan on buying it and what are your reasons for buying it? And do you think that this game is actually trying to feed off the past success of previous uh, previously released Batman games? Or do you feel as though, like I said, it's just if you know if you put Batman on something, it's gonna be popular because Batman is popular. Um, uh, we won both matches, didn't we win? Yeah, we won both matches. It's pretty awesome, you know. Uh, I went undefeated the first match. I went <laughs> two and zero. Oh. It's really nothing to pat my back about, but I rarely ever get undefeated in first-person shooters on anything. Normally, I would start off real good. I'm like, man, I'm gonna get you know, I'm gonna go undefeated, and then I got killed by a camper. There is some campers in this game, just like any other first-person shooter game, uh, but not that much. Anyway, this match is over. This video is almost over. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, spread the word. This is a really good game, and it's supposed to be $15 uh, on PSN and uh, Microsoft, which is doing the uh, going away from the Microsoft points, and that has pissed a lot of people off. So um, I'm not having it, and I'm out. No, I'm not out. I'm lying. Um... Like I said before, like, comment, subscribe, spread the word. Uh, just give me your general thoughts on this game and what you guys like. And also, um, like I said, like the Facebook page. Check out the Blog Talk Radio. This is what I was, what I envisioned for Game Caviar has having a full entertainment circle of YouTube, uh, internet radio, and Facebook, and possibly, probably Google Plus later on this year. So. Um, Hit me up, man. I'll be here. I'll talk to you. I'm not having it, and I'm out.